So, uh, what's up guys? Rick here, and, uh, I've been working on this mob trap here for a little bit now. I've gotten kind of the blueprints going. I guess you should say the layout. It's gonna be 12 layers. This is, uh, bottom floor right here. Although, I got this right here where, uh, if I'm standing out around here, and there's mobs spawning here. They won't spawn anywhere on these bottom layers. Like the bottom three or four layers. So. I. Figured that I would probably end up carving out a valley through here. With a lot of TNT. And fortunately the reason why I made this mob trap is for TNT. So my friend has yet another project that requires TNT. So yeah, I've been working on that. I got the top two floors uh, pretty much done. Um, and I just started working my way down so that I could work from bottom up instead of top down so I won't keep falling and dying. I've already fell a few times now. And uh, also there was also a little floating island in the middle here. I just completely carved all of that out. Got rid of it completely. And uh... Yeah, that's pretty much it right there. I've also uh, did some adjustments to the mass. I started filling the chests back in, chest chests back in, stuff like that. And uh, also, you may notice over there, um, someone you might know, Bernie Beast, visited my server or came up on my stream last night, uh, just looking for a random Minecraft stream to mess around with. And ended up joining my server. He built that. He attached it to his day and night sensor so it flashes at night and stays off during the day. Yeah, that's pretty cool over there. We also had some uh, bow and arrow trick shot challenges over by the arrow farm, way over there in the desert. That was pretty fun. I had a. Uh, see what I hit. I had. We jumped off this, uh, like, huge sand cliff. Um, what you did was you do like a 180, like from jumping right here, there's like a chest off to your left. You do a 180, open the chest, swing back around, and then hit the shot. I hit that. That was pretty neat. And uh, my friend uh, Seoxity, as well as uh, Bernie Beast, he was, well, it was mostly just Seoxity, but he was uh, working on my cow farm here. He's trying to make it right. I don't think his idea is going to work though because he's going to have a whole bunch of pistons lining the walls here and then the water is going to go to the center and push the cows there. I don't think that's going to work very well because that requires way too many pistons for really I don't think what it's worth it. So that's probably going to be changed here again. But yeah until then just have cows roaming around there and this mob trap right in front of it. <laughs> this is probably going to end up re being relocated anyway since this whole area is going to be TNT'd eventually. But until then, uh, it's going to have the mob trap slightly inefficient. And uh, let's see here. I as well show you what I've done to the mass now. I have, don't have much on me, just mainly snow and dirt that I've been picking up. So uh, let's see here. Oh yeah, he also made his uh, little room inside my house here. This is his room right here, pretty beast. Not much, but yeah. He also uh, centered the portal right here, so there it's uh, not offset and in the corner. It's actually centered perfectly with all the chests right there. See so, yeah, how that's that, and down here he has to put a window right there. So look down here. Um, that remains unmodified. Uh, let's see here. Oh yeah, uh, I added a snow farm right here just so I can get a bunch of snow. No, oh, well I thought there was some in there, but I guess not. I guess I grabbed it all. And uh, let's see here. Let me get back up to the mass now and show you what's up there. I'm not talking straight today. Oh wait, so uh, 
I made a bunch of wooden slabs because I know that uh, wooden slabs made in this update are going to be fireproof. Any wooden slabs made in the next update are not, so I've just been kind of preparing that in case I need any invincible wooden slabs. So uh, I came up with the design for this right here. I went with nether brick and the creeper face sandstone. Yeah. I think that looks really good with iron bars and all. And I decided not to have any blocks within like the chest area right here. I guess I'm just gonna like designate a section to have like a certain type of block since well there's four sections, twelve sections total really. So <laughs> I haven't filled in this side yet. I've got half of it done now. So yeah, huge storage system. I don't think I'll be using in like not even half the chests that are in here. But may as well have them for the lulls. A bunch of furnaces too. Don't have anything in them. Except for these, I think. Yeah. I have stone in them. There's some more chests and stuff like that. Random stuff. And, uh. Oh, yeah. Uh. Let's see here. I think it's down here. Um. Verney also, uh, modified this right here to kind of even it out a little bit. And make it a little bit better. Move the staircase that was right here down that way. And, uh center of the staircase right here with this decorative pillar. Oh yeah, let's see, it's turning night time. Let's see if I could, uh... Oh, it's still broken glass here. Yeah, he accidentally broke it because he thought he could pick it up and get a better view of that. So, uh, let's see if we could, uh, wait since it's turning night time now. Let's zoom in. No, it doesn't help that much. Come on. During night time. Wait, let's see here. I'm going to zoom in with Optifine. Hopefully it's not cheaty. Well, it probably is cheaty to some, but whatever. Oh, there we go. It switched. There we go. Yeah. That's pretty neat over there. He said he wanted to cover it up, too, so you don't see the wiring and stuff. Oh, there's creepers down there. So, uh, let's see here. What else is there? Um, well, uh, oh, this door is open. It's not supposed to be. Oh, man, what else did I modify? Oh, yeah, um, my friend Zeoxy, he finally, uh, moved out from the house across the street pretty much um I think I'm just gonna walk over there <laughs> so I don't have a minecart on me and I'm too lazy to get it but yeah that hill is now vacant he used to have his little mansion there I didn't even finish it but uh he decided that he would just go ahead and move away so uh we could both have plenty of room to build stuff. We found a nice little, uh, like, hill in the middle of the plains area. And started building his house up there. Jeez, look how tall that thing is. It goes all the way up to, uh, Y level 127, right below the old height limit. Actually, I think the old height limit was 127, not 128. At least the max build height was. Um. But, uh. Yeah, let's see. Where was he going? Yeah, so his house isn't there anymore. His stuff still is, though. Um, well, some of it is. But uh, he moves, like, way over there. I'm going to go ahead and walk over there until I'll meet you when I get over there. Alright, so uh, we're here now at his house. Well, his soon-to-be house. He hasn't gotten much done yet besides, like, the outlines. Pretty much a square box right now. Pretty sure he'll decorate it more later. But, uh... Yeah, he he got some uh, sandstone and nether brick floors right here. I kind of helped him with the design of that and stuff like that. It's in a spiral pattern. Going, uh, I think it's counterclockwise. This is just going to be a huge storage room, whatever. And uh, down here is uh, going to be his like central hub area. This is what he's going to be needing a bunch of TNT for. I've already used some TNT on it already. 
There's some cave systems through here and stuff like that that you have to block off and explore. And uh, it's going to be 50 by 50, 25 in each f four directions. And uh, this is the absolute center right here. Um, is This is going to be where he connects all of his different places to. And uh, it's going to be huge. It's going to be 5 tall, 50 by 50. And it's going to be in a circular shape. So far we've gotten from sh only this much cleared out with TNT and digging. But uh, yeah, that's just his base right there. He hasn't set up his nether portal yet, so can't make another track yet for him. <clears throat> I'm probably going to end up doing that for the um, the railway to the mine shaft even too, maybe. But uh, yeah, that's his base right there, not much. He's got some birch trees out here for the wood to his house. But um, it, let's see here, that forest right there is going to be on the other side of the desert that holds the mine shaft in it as well as the village so uh, I'm gonna head back over there and show you the other side of it so you can kind of tell where this is alright so I'm over here now I'm at the minecart track that has the mine shaft here and the village is over there that's the forest that I was telling you about right across from the desert and the plains so this house is all the way in that dark and it kind of gives you a kind of a view of this world right here. There's this desert, the huge mountain in the middle of it. There's a village right there. There's a forest right there. And past that, it's plains and an ocean. That's where Seoxy's house is. My house is way over there. So, uh, that's pretty much it to it. Oh, yeah, I should also uh, mention during a live stream, I uh, cleared out this mine shaft down here. So, uh, yeah, now it's all nice and fancy. You got a stone brick on the floors. It's all cleaned up mostly. You got rid of most of the lava here. It's, now it's just some obsidian left that I have to dig out. <sighs> but yeah, so I actually almost died. I think I actually think I told you in that one video. Or did I tell you? I don't know. It was a, it was a while ago. I was digging out some obsidian around here and then the water stream because I was doing that water over obsidian trick to mine it more safely. The water ran out in the last block. I was like, oh man, I wasn't pressing shift, stuff like that. So it's kind of a face palm moment. So, is there anything I bring back? No, I don't have a full inventory. I have to walk up this since I don't have a minecart. But yeah, so I almost died there. Lost my diamond armor that time. That's why I'm using arm, iron armor now. And, uh, yeah, that's pretty much it right there. I think I've already told you that before. I tweeted it out, um, a while back, but yeah. That was a pretty close call. It scared the living hell out of me. Alright, so I'm gonna, uh, stop the recording right here and meet you back at my base. <clears throat> Alright, so I'm back here. This is the mob trap right here in the mob tower. Um, actually, I actually don't even know why I made it out of snow. I guess it was just like a random cho choice. My friend just like randomly brought up like, you know what, let's make it out of snow. And I'm like, oh, alright, whatever. Snow is easy to get. I'll just make a snow farm out of it. So, yeah, it's almost night time, so I think I might sleep first before starting on this again and then ending the episode. But, uh, yeah. Although, if you guys aren't checking out my live stream, I s highly suggest you do. Just follow me on Twitch TV, you'll get like an email notification whenever I go live. I'll also tweet it out too, so follow me there if you don't use emails. But, uh, yeah. I do live stream frequently. I plan to live stream today if I can. I don't know if I can or not. I have to look into that. But, uh,. Yeah, I live stream frequently, like either every day or every other day. Um, so yeah, check me out on there. It's usually either Minecraft, Battlefield Three, or some other weird game. Oh yeah, Pokemon too. I stream Pokemon. So if you're a fan of Pokemon, follow me on there. If uh, oops, that's not the way. If you're a fan of Minecraft, follow me on there. If you like to watch Battlefield 3, 
follow me on there. So yeah. <laughs> this is pretty much the only games I stream. I could probably try to stream more. Like GTA 4 or something like that. But I don't know if anybody would be interested in that. So uh, yeah, let's uh, hit up there real quick. <sighs> yeah, um, I had about Bernie Beast. If you haven't even heard of him, though, uh, check him out. His YouTube channel is uh, youtube.com slash Bernie Beast. I'll put in the link in the description, so you can just click on that instead of having to look him up. So, uh, yeah. Let's head up here. I haven't fully finished this floor yet. I need to. Alright, so I got that floor done. I got the top part filled in. I corrected the corners here. Now that's all good. I just need to pretty much fill it and finish the other layers now. The other, like, let's see. This is the second layer. I need to finish the other 10 layers. It's going to be a lot. This is going to take forever. Also, I should mention, uh, I have new render settings. So, yeah. I mentioned that in my last video. I got new render settings. That was on Battlefield 3. Now you should be seeing this on Minecraft. It looks amazing on Minecraft. You can't really tell on Battlefield 3 because, yeah, I was playing on all low settings so I can actually play. But, uh, let's see here. I need to take down this cobblestone tower here so it doesn't get in my way. So, yeah, um, there's that. And, uh, yeah. So I got new render settings, pretty neat. I now just use Sony Vegas to edit and then use MEGUI to render it all. And the, uh, here it's X264 in, uh, encoder. Um, yeah, I think that's it, X264. It's kind of based off, uh, what's it called? Um, H264, high quality encoder. Um, except it's kind of like uh, I don't I don't know, but it's just kind of a different version of it. Um, so yeah, I render in extreme quality now, all 1080p. Even though I don't have five upload, <laughs> but the files are amazingly compressed too for a uh, for like what a five minute video. It goes down to uh, about. Well, 700 MB, but that's a that's amazing quality for nearly lossless. Because when you play it back on your computer, you can't really tell the difference between that and uh, and in like a raw recording, pretty much. Although YouTube still compresses it down even further to like uh, MP4 format. So yeah, the quality is reduced, but can't really help that. It's just YouTube. It's how they roll. Nobody likes them. So yeah, I'm getting... Yeah, I'm just getting this done right now. Probably just end the recording right here, so yeah. Uh, this has been kind of a little update since the last video, about a month ago. And uh, I'll catch you later. Catch you next time. So yeah, see ya.